up everyone, it's Sam from Inside the Bottle TV. Today we're doing a quick pro tip on a wine that isn't quite red wine, and definitely isn't white wine, it's rosé. And, geez, that running back and forth got me out of breath. <laughs> but anyways, um, here's something cool, it's summertime guys, and well, I guess springtime here in Portland, Maine, it's still kind of chilly out, uh, but here's your summertime favorite Rosé wine is uh, a dry wine. You can also get them sweet. They have added sugar. Um, but anyways, there is a number of black grape varietals that go into these bottles of Rosé. Here's one that's a little darker. Here's one that's a, uh, that's a bit lighter. And uh, these are great wines. They have a lot of fruit. Uh, you, you'll, you'll get strawberries out of it. You know, a lot of uh, flour. Um, like different flower scents out of them. Uh, they're beautiful wines. Some of the great varietals that are in a rosé, Grenache, Sangiovese, uh, Syrah, Mouvedre, Carignon, Cinso, and the last one is Pinot Noir. And these are beautiful wines, again, wonderful to enjoy. You can make mixed cocktails out of them. There's just so many things you can do when you're sitting at a picnic or you're out with your family or friends. Um, wonderful wines to enjoy for the summertime. Now, how do you serve them? What temperature do you serve them at? These wines are best served between 48 and 53 degrees Fahrenheit. Um, these wines also are going to be served just a little bit warmer than any white wine that you have. There is a rule of thumb. This rule of thumb is to serve rosé at a uh, colder temperature for the darker wine, uh, darker colored rosés, which you would find like here. So it's just a little bit darker. And for the lighter ones, you should chill them just a little bit more. And I always recommend to my family and friends to chill a nice bottle of rosé for an hour, hour and a half before they open the bottle. And so that is the pro tip for today, guys. I hope you guys can all go out and enjoy these beautiful rosés. Uh, this year's vintage, even going to last year's vintage, is probably the best um, move that you can make and enjoy yourselves. So, uh, follow us on Instagram, guys, at Inside the Bottle TV. Also, if you subscribe to our channel below our YouTube uh, videos, I would be amazingly grateful, and so would the rest of the team that's standing over here. Uh, we hope you guys enjoy these videos and. Uh, you know, social presence for us is extremely important. You know, we strive to work extremely hard to make these videos possible for you guys. And uh, on a weekly basis as well, every Thursday at 7 p.m. we air them. You can watch them whenever you want, which is the coolest thing. It kind of keeps us on schedule to air them on Thursday at 7. So social media is huge. Please subscribe, please share. Go to our Facebook page at Inside the Bottle TV. And stay tuned for more, uh, more episodes.